There is a new manager for La Tri and it is Felix Sanchez. In today's video, we're going to break down the new manager of the Ecuador national team, Felix Sanchez, the former Qatar manager. Is this the right hiring or did Ecuador bottle this and they should have gone for Ricardo Gareca? Let's discuss it right now. So as we could see here, the Ecuador Football Federation announced that the Spaniard Felix Sanchez is the new head coach of the national team. The 47-year-old Spaniard coached Qatar in the World Cup but recently failed to advance from the group stage and therefore became the worst ever host in World Cup history. Let's discuss about this hiring. Ecuador football is at a peak right now. We just saw what the Independiente de Valle just did. They won the Recopa against Flamengo. We saw how the national team did at the World Cup. They were excellent. Obviously, lost to Senegal and went out of the group stage, but they are such a good team. They have so many exciting youngsters. Moises Caicedo, Sarmiento, Estupiñan. I, I can go on and on. Ecuador keep on producing ballers and ballers. They have some 15-year-old player for Independiente de Valle that Chelsea and all these big clubs in Europe are going after. So you see the talent pool for Ecuador it might become the third best in, in South America after Argentina and Brazil. So obviously we know heading into the next World Cup qualifiers, Ecuador are deducted minus three points because of the involvement of an ineligible player. So the FA had to pay some fines. Now, what I need to understand from Ecuadorians, and you guys can let me know in, in the comments down below if you're Ecuadorian. Why don't you go for Ricardo Gareca? Is he just too expensive? Now I understand now Gareca went to another club in Argentina, but really? You couldn't just pay a little bit more to get that manager who, you know, produces good football, gets results. We saw what he did with Peru, made it to a Copa America final against Brazil in 2019. You couldn't do that if you're the FA, just pay a little bit more. Because with Felix Sanchez, he's a good manager. He won the Asian Cup with Qatar, but there was an expectation with Qatar. They, had, they played very well. They were playing 4-3-3. And then all of a sudden, he switched to a 5-3-2 formation. And it just seemed like it was getting worse and worse from the football with Qatar. And now, he gets the Ecuadorian job. This kind of reminds me of when Carlos Quiros got the Colombian job. It made absolutely no sense. And we saw what happened. He lost to Ecuador 6-1 and got sacked. I hope this doesn't happen for Ecuador because... They're on a really good path and I'm really excited for the national team and I think a lot of Ecuadorians are because they just see the football is getting better. They keep producing ballers and it can only get better and better. But if you do not have the right man as the manager, if he doesn't have the right tactics, you saw with Gustavo Alvaro, he was able to switch formations, switch the tactics, get the youngsters involved. I just feel like with Felix Sanchez, he's a one trick pony. He plays 5-3-2 and that is it. And we see with Ecuador, they use a lot of wingers. And I just don't think Felix Sanchez is a manager who likes to use those wingers. He, of course, he wants to keep a possession style of play, pressing. That's something that Ecuador are familiar to. But with a 5-3-2 formation, to me, this screams the cheap option. We saw Felix Sanchez was about to be the manager of Iran. Didn't happen. Now he gets the Ecuador job. I don't know. I, I don't know because... He's got a big job on his hands because we see that the, now there's expectation. It's not just about, okay, qualify for the World Cup. You better be making it to the round of 16. Copa America, you better be making it to the semifinals. That is the expectation now for Ecuador to keep these hype standards that they've been proving themselves in the last couple of years. But Felix Sanchez is a risky and a cheap hiring. And I hope it works out. But I have a lot, a lot of question marks around it. If they hired Gareca... This would be a completely different story. Then I would be like, you know what? Ecuador could probably win the next Copa America. They could. But with Felix Sanchez? I don't know. I don't know. It, it just seems like the FA really bottled this hiring. So I want to hear your thoughts in the comments down below of Felix Sanchez becoming the new manager of the Ecuadorian national team. Now, of course, look, we've seen a lot of weird hirings in international football. We saw Jurgen Klinsmann go to South Korea. We saw Roberto Martinez go to Portugal. We have to give them time and we can't judge them too early. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new rounder. And every Ecuadorian, let me know your thoughts in the comments down below of Felix Sanchez, the new manager of La Tri. Stay safe in this crazy world. And until next time, adios.